episode 14 of our second series of the 10p hunts. We've got a £100 seal bag of 10 pence coins for you today. Hopefully we're going to have a little bit better luck than we've had in the last few episodes and also um, the last few times we've gone to the post office, but I'll tell you about that in a minute. Uh, and we're trying to find every alphabet 2018 and 2019 coin to go on our album. So we want them sat alongside each other. So we haven't got that many, although considering how bloody scarce they seem to be these days, I think we're doing, uh, we're doing pretty well. So they're the coins that we've got. We also have some uh, Territories coins that we keep in the back of the album as well. So let's get this, uh, this bag ripped open. So it is another Birmingham bag. And those of you who saw the last episode will know it was a complete bust. Uh, it's similar date as well in November 2019. But we have had a, a look through, a quick can look through as much as we can. And there is definitely the 2016 shields in here but there's also some coins which aren't 2016 so, yeah so there is at least some in there but i suspect that we're going to get a, another stack of 2016 so they have been really really hard to come by um alphabets of late and in fact it's been really hard just being able to find 10 p's or uh, seal bags of 10 p's that aren't all the same uh, aren't all the same year I mean, even just looking at these, no, no, 2006, right, bonus. I've definitely got something uh, different, uh, different in here. So I know that in episode 13, which was the Bir Birmingham bust, we had two coin, two bags that were full of the same, the same uh, year. Um, we went to the post office again after that, and I got another bag full of 2000 and. 16 shields so i've got another bust and then lady m um i think what we'll do lady i don't think we'll look for the years on this one we'll just we'll just do this as a pure alphabet hunt okay. we won't look we won't look for the years um so it was a uh, what was i saying 2016 it was another bust so that, that made three bags in a row lady m then went a few days later and uh and you got what was it 2017. Yeah, there was. I had a chance of three bags, and um, the first two lot of bags that I sort through were 2017s, and thankfully the third bag was this bag. Yeah, it's, it's really it's really kind of uh, of the uh, the lady in the post office where we get the the coins. She allows us to have a look through the through the bag to check that they aren't all the same variation. So even though there's a big queue and of course this time of year as well, a lot of parcels and letters are going off. Um, so we are very grateful for for our friend at the post office letting us look for them. I'm not sure that someone's been colouring that in. Oh, it's just had a really rough life. Um, I think it's probably about right at this time to say Merry Christmas to everybody. Yes. So happy holidays or whatever it is you say, wherever you come from. We, we are Merry Christmas kind of guys um, because this will be going up on Christmas Day. So we're actually filming it. 20, is it the 20th today? Yeah. So it's a Friday night. So this is how, this is how Lady M and I spend our Friday nights. And could there be anything... Rock and could, roll. Could there be anything better? Um, so yeah, it's Friday Friday night and we are filming this ready for Christmas Day on Wednesday. So so Merry Christmas. Um, by this time as well, you'll probably know all about the giveaway. So we've got a blockbuster giveaway. So for our 1,000 subscribers. And we'll draw it as soon as we get to 1,000 subscribers or... Um, a little while after we get our 1,000 subscribers. We want to get a little bit of a buffer, don't we, Lady? And we don't want to hit 1,000, yeah. draw the winner, and then have a few people unsubscribe. Um, so hopefully the first week, maybe second week of January, the, at the latest, we will draw that blockbuster prize. So please do go and uh, uh, enter that giveaway. So have, have a look back. It'll be a couple, not last video, the video... Um, before will be our giveaway you shouldn't be able to miss it and what do you need to do to enter you need to make sure you subscribe that's the most important thing because we do need to get to a thousand subscribers before we draw it um please like the video and leave a comment in the video preferably a question so looking forward to being able to draw that and give someone an absolute bounty of uh, of coins bunk coins and some special uh, exclusive uh, channel merchandise something that lady m herself has crafted whittled herself with a whole own fair hand so i won't spoil anything but do go and have a have a look at it and i want to thank uh, mark bennett as well 
at uh, raftree.co.uk because he's made us some exclusive uh, exclusive merchandise as well. So thanks, uh, thanks very much for that. And of course, giveaways. We will be drawing the giveaway uh, from episode 12, is it, Lady M? Episode 12. Yes. So you'll get the uh, if you if you subscribed and you left a comment in episode 12, you've got a chance of winning a Gruffalo. Um, and we want to thank the GreatBridgeCoinland.com for sponsoring the channel, as uh, as them guys always do, and providing the uh, the prize. Uh, it's also worth noting that our, our giveaway, what we've done with the with the giveaway, um, is that we've used our points. So we so we've used some of our points that we well we used all the points that we've accumulated in uh, these 10p videos. Because regular viewers for the 10p vids will know that it's a challenge video. So we get you get three points if you find an alphabet, two points if you find the territories, and a point if you find a fallen coin. And whoever gets the most points at the end of the episode gets a £10 credit at thegreatbridgecoinland.com. So ready for the giveaway, we cashed all our points in and we bought some uh, some bunk packs, some bunk coins, brilliant uncirculated. And I say go and have a look at the uh, giveaway video to see what's what. So a big thank you to the Great British Coin Hunt for not only providing a weekly prize, but for helping us um, have a blockbuster of a, um, of a giveaway for our 1,000 subscribers as well. So big thanks, uh, big thanks for that. What we normally do is that we would also look for the low mintage years, but we're not doing that today. I just want to boof it through. It's Christmas Day. I'm sure we want to get back to doing whatever it is that you, uh, that you normally do. So this is just going to be an alphabet territories or foreign coin hunt only so i can probably imagine there's going to be a massive wedge <laughs> of uh, a video that we're just about to uh, we're just about to cut out i think because uh, they are they are really scarce aren't they lady yeah. to, to come by it seems to be so other other coin tubers they seem to be struggling to find them um they just they just get it's, it's going to become a real achievement in order to uh, to, to get an alphabet i'm sure Ooh, a bit grubby we know we only, we only have 220,000 of each letter of 2018s. We don't know the mintage figures for 2019. But my hunch is it's going to be half of that. It's going to be 110,000 because they only released one uh, lot into circulation or announced only one batch going in where they announced two batches of the 2018 coins. So I think that uh, unless it, we've only got a few days left of this year, so unless they just didn't bother announcing it, the 2019s are going to be even rarer. So my advice, if you can't have across any alphabets, then do uh, do keep them or swap them for other alphabets to complete your set. But don't uh, don't sell them. They, they might go for a pound a pound or so now. You still get some of them on the Royal Mint website for two pounds, depending what offers are on and whether you pay for courses or whatever. You. But they are going to go up and up and up. The um, at some point they're going to be worth. They're going to be worth ten pound each, lady, and that's my prediction. Well, wow. I suppose eventually with inflation, I'll be I'll be proved right at some point. But, <laughs> um, I reckon that in the not too distant future, maybe you know, it'll be, it'll be years, I think, but not too many. They're going to be worth uh, an absolute fortune. Right. So what we're going to do now is we will will speed up or take a massive chunk out of the video, and uh, we we will show you if we've got anything interesting. And if we don't come across anything interesting, well, we'll be we'll go straight into the straight into the giveaway. So stay tuned for that. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh! Lady M, Ooh. Lady M's got a find. Ooh. Lady M has got a find. Repeat, repeat. Lady M is probably winning the uh, episode. With a find, what is it, Lady M? It's a territory of some description. It's got ten pence written on it. Looks yeah. like a like a castle-y. So it's yeah. got definitely gonna be some kind of island. And it is Gibraltarian. Nice. Wow, so that is that is awesome, that Lady M. Excellent. Let's, can I just have a little crush him? A little, little bit of a close up there. So you do enjoy this while we uh, <laughs> yeah. while we can. Because they are so scarce. Two pointer as well, Lady M. Nice. Definitely a coin we haven't got 1994, so it'll definitely yeah, be going in the. Yeah, I don't recognise that one. Definitely be going in the album that one. Excellent. I was going to say exactly the same thing. Excellent there. Yeah. Well, thank you, to Lady M. She's left me half of her final bag. 
So, looking pretty grim again on the alphabet stakes. So I'm gonna think I'll do a triple somersault when we do actually <laughs> actually find one. But uh, yep, yeah, this is the, the tail end, oops, tail end of the hunt now. Thank you, Lady M, for being so generous. No problem. Right, and hope, it, hopefully I can replay that generosity with an alphabet, but I have mm. indeed have not. Right, so this is the uh, this is the find. This is it. Oh, look at the state of my hands. I've got. Oh, the, look at mine. I've got. Uh, I've got Christopher Collect's finger. Mm -hmm. So I have to go and watch that. So that's the plum find that will be going into the uh, album. Do you want to get straight on with the draw, Lady M? Right. Uh, yeah. Can do. So we're playing for a Gruffalo coin. So thank you very much. Oh, oh Matt moved as well. So you're playing for this. So thank you very okay. much, you everybody who went to the giveaway in episode twelve. So we've got rid of the uh, duplicate users. Yeah. All the comments are in, just boof it, lady, I'm just go for it. Cool. And the winner of this fantastic Gruffalo coin, thanks to the great British coin and dot com, is one 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 compulsions. Or is that 111? Or triple one compulsions? Well, Ellie strikes back. What a comeback. Put it in your put you in your place, Bunkle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so Ellie Ellie did uh, Ellie did come back for a bit, but then she yeah, she ditched us again. So never mind, I'm sure she'll be back at some point. So well done. One 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 or triple one or hundred and eleven compulsions. Thank you very much for uh, for entering the giveaway. Please do make contact with us. So send us an email, bungle collects uh, at gmail.com or Facebook through Messenger or Instagram. Uh, give us a shout and we'll verify who you are and then we will get your prize off to you. So it's uh, it's Christmas Day, unless you're watching in the future. So hello, future people watching. It's Christmas Day, 2019. So we won't be able to get it posted off straight away with the Christmas yeah. post, but we'll do what we can for you. So well done. And if you want to win another Gruffalo coin, so remember, these uh, these are not in circulation. The Royal Mint did not release them into circulation, but the Great British Coin Hunt com and ourselves... Uh, Bungle Collects Coins has released uh, 850 into circulation, so you've got a chance of finding one in your change. But if you don't want to wait on that chance of finding one, then you can enter the giveaway for this week and we'll draw it next week. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, like this video, leave a comment, preferably a question, and we'll give you a chance to win it uh, to win that next week. So you want to do the uh, honours lady out? There you go. Gibraltarian coin 1994. So they are, in, they are in alphabetical order as well because we are looking for alphabets. So there's the Falklands and there are the Gibraltar. So look, it's mm -hmm. going to be our fourth different Gibraltarian yeah. coin that we found in this series of the 10p hunts. Wow. So well uh, well pleased with that. So do you want to stick it in there, Lady M? Fantastic. So there it is in the uh, in the book. So thanks to the greatbridgecoinland.com for sponsoring the episode and giving us the giveaway prizes. And thanks for all the points that we've accumulated over the uh, the 13 previous episodes. We've used our points to add it into a giveaway prize for our 1,000 subscriber giveaway. So please don't forget to go over and uh, unsubscribe to that. Did we show what the winner had won? The winner of what? The winner of this week's... Yes, yeah, the Gruffalo coin. Is that, oh, right, yeah, was it that one? Yeah. Sorry. Um, yeah, thank It's okay, you. We'll, we'll edit this out, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so uh, all I want to say is um, please do subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification bell. You can send us a, a Facebook request, on, no, a friend request on Facebook at Bungle Collects. We're on Bungle underscore Collects on Instagram. And yeah, thank you very much and Merry Christmas, everybody. Thanks for all the support you've given us over the uh, over our first year of the, of the channel. Hope you have a great Christmas day, or if it's after Christmas, Hello to you, future you watching this. Hopefully, uh, we're well over a thousand subscribers by now, and uh, we've got you know hundreds and hundreds of videos for you to watch and go back and watch our back catalogue. All right, great. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode.